Hi there, uh, good day. For today's vlog, I'm going to teach you on how to extract AVCS weekly updates, which includes your AVCS or the ENC permits and the AIO using Windows Viewer. So first, we'll try to open Windows Viewer. Just click, double click, and it's gonna open like this. Okay, there you go. So that is my Windows Viewer. So what you're going to do is that you click on the arrow. Okay, then click charts and on the right corner you will see the uh, chart buttons and just try to click up to date left click and automatically it will be updated to the latest notice to mariners as you can see it's already downloading all licensed charts I have about 97 ENC permits or chart licenses okay it's updating to the next notice to miners, which is week 14. <clears throat> so we wait for a while. So we're going to extract this on our dedicated USB. Okay. After that, uh, we're going to install it on our ECDIS Transas and also on our JRC radar chart which will be included on my next blog. As you can see, AVCS catalog is updated to week 14 and also the AIO catalog is updated to week 14 as well. And uh, updating charts. Now it's installing uh, three license charts okay if there's still a yellow color you are going to click one more time for it to be updated because it just downloaded the previously requested charts I have requested online okay this one it says buy charts uh, 37 charts can be renewed click the button about to add to the chart order but I'm not going to use this because these were the charts that were previously used and was or is already expired as of now okay wait for a moment <clears throat> by the way this is when this viewer Okay, this is for our ECDIS and radar charts updates. Also, uh, this one, this viewer can also be used with the subscription on your ENPs or the previously what we call the Admiralty Sailing Directions and also other uh, electronic publications. Now, as you can see, it says up to date. Okay, to date. There are 97 chart licenses and updated to the latest notice manners week 14. So how are you going to extract since you have just uploaded, uh, updated your Wendis viewer? So go to export for this, click on it. And then after that, you have to click browse, left click, and then on the desktop, just save it on the desktop, click ABCS. So first, we're going to delete the previously saved. So this is the one. Delete all folders. Okay. And close. Also on the AIO folder, left click, highlight, then delete. Okay because you are going to save the new ones so you're not going to need this uh, week 13 okay you're going to use the week 14 so click when this viewer again there you go so again go for export for like this browse then click avcs on your desktop click ok now you see it's it's going to save on your desktop ABCS. Then click export. Then click, of course, ABCS because it will be saved. The ABCS permits and the updates will be 
save on the AVCS folder. Exporting a standard exchange set to update charts on ECDIS and also on your radar charts. Now it's done. Okay. It's already saved as you can see here. Export April 9. Okay, manual. Then it's saved on your desktop AVCS. Okay. There's the export log. Next is that you click on browse again. Then this time we're going to save AIO. So click the folder AIO, click OK, and then click export. Then click AIO or the Admiralty information overlay. Okay, it's as fast as you click. Now it's already saved desktop AIO. Go to the exports, April 9, 0505, AIO week 14. Okay, export log is there. Meaning it's already saved on your on your uh, folders that you made on your desktop. Then minimize. Then just simply copy this one. Highlight. Right click. Copy. Okay. And then save it on your USB. Then click on the when this weekly update right click and paste once it's done then you can now we can now update it on our this and also on our radar charts which will be included on my next blog installing enc permits and updating to the latest notice to mariners Now it's all done. Now go back. On also on my next blog, I'm going to uh, make a blog, educational video regarding on how to update your transas at this by installing your CA file updates and also on how to export SPOS root suggestion. Okay, SPOS it's a weather forecasting uh, software for your navigation. Okay, it is always uh, as per the definition of navigation, it is not always the shortest route that you will consider, but you will consider also the fuel consumption and all most importantly is the safest route. Okay, especially if you will be navigating nearby low pressure area or bad weather. So that is all gentlemen and ladies for my blog. Thank you very much and hope to see you soon on my next blog.